Disclaimer. I love Steven Universe. This series is done purely for fun and to point out some flaws in Steven Universe logic, not for any malicious or defaming intentions. Thank you. So after I finish writing my scripts, I like to visit the episode Steven Universe wiki page in order to pick up on errors I may have missed. For Gem Drill, however, this is listed. Now, I can't 100% confirm that this is true or not, as my Google searches have turned up nothing, and I don't recall seeing this error when I first watched on TV. Thus, I'm not gonna add a sin for it, but I wanted to let you guys know in case it is true. Anyway, I can highlight multiple instances of the storyboarding for this episode being rather subpar in comparison to other episodes. I normally don't notice it as much, so it must be especially egregious here. I get there are different storyboarders for different episodes to make production faster, but that doesn't help that some of these shots just look plain ugly to me. Say, we'll do it together and it's gonna be great! We're gonna do it together and it's gonna be great! Liar! It's actually two more hours to the cluster. The Earth will probably be destroyed by then. Seriously, you didn't think to spring for some kind of faster turbo mode or something? If that would possibly injure Steven, simply don't bring him along. I can't even... Uh, stretch out. It's a drill. Did you expect some kind of luxury suite? How'd you think you were gonna get everyone in here anyway? We didn't have a lot of time to plan. Perhaps if the Crystal Gems didn't spend all that time doing nothing, maybe you could have planned all this out better. Gee, it's almost as if Peridot was right. It's hard not to have some feelings for where you came from. Especially since you changed allegiances literally three episodes ago. This is so fucking rushed. Something doesn't feel right about this. Then use the D-pad. Steven, I'm sorry I couldn't save you or the billions of other life forms who matter far, far less to me. Do you have any last words? You could be drilling right now instead of just giving up. The pod suddenly grows in size in this shot just for the sake of this angle. You'd think if this was a matter of life or death, she wouldn't just be sitting there. Also, I never brought this up before because I never really thought about it until now, but... What good did Peridot think a drill would do? Think about it, there's billions of different gem shards in the Earth at this point, right? With a density that big, surely Peridot would realize that a measly Earth drill wouldn't be enough to break through that many shards at once. Especially if the shards can survive something like magma. And even if the drill was really the only option the gems had at that point in time, you'd think Peridot would try to account for the weakness of the drill's, well, drilling capabilities by upgrading its parts a little. Seriously, how did Peridot think this would work? Activating triple tip penetration mode! Oh fucking god! What exactly is stopping them from forming? Even when Steven convinces them and makes them want to stay, they then say they, quote, can't stop and are going to form. Yet here they are, still not formed, even when they wanted to form. Ugh, this reeks of plot contrivance. <gasps> They're bubbling each other! How the fuck? They've probably never even heard of the concept of bubbling for at least thousands of years, let alone them being fucking shards. Yet suddenly they could just bubble each other on a whim? Steven bubbled five out of billions. This is the conclusion this arc has been building up to for half a fucking season? This is literally fan fiction levels of writing, come on! Ugh. 25 sins, please. How on earth did you bubble that whole thing? Pearl would be so great at everything wrong with, it's almost like the Crooniverse knew how stupid that resolution was. I didn't comment on this last time because, well, frankly, I always stop watching episodes right before the credits. But the song that plays during the credits here, despite the fact that it only lasts like 10 seconds, sounds really damn good. Take a listen. Yeah. 
Special thanks to my Mach 2 members, Bear Kawaii Desu, who wants me to say. 646464 64, 64, Zulane. Caden, who wants me to say. Fortnite and Trash is identical. They're just the same. Cormac Crawley, who wants me to say. Hey, guess what? Fuck you. Dank Dudes, who wants me to say. Wood Fired Pizza? How's pizza gonna get a job now? Felipe de Stick Figure, who wants me to say. Totodile is the best starter of Gen 2. Come at me. Honey X, who didn't provide me a phrase to say this week. Kawaii Kitten, who wants me to say, and I apologize in advance for this. When will you learn? When will you learn that your actions have consequences? I did a toad voice and I don't know why. Mikey X, who wants me to say. If you're hearing this, you must be gay, gay, gay. Octo, who wants me to say. One plus one equals three if you don't use a condom. Stay safe, kids. And Waluigi the Taco Stand guy, who wants me to say. Intel Core i3 is better than whatever Steven's GameCube is. I want to also say thank you to my Mach 1 members, Angelix8, Keefman Maximum Gamer, and Lemercy. If you wish to become a member, click the join button down below and follow the on-screen instructions.